The wine grape growers are used to dealing with all sorts of stuff from droughts to floods and fires, but now they're facing some new challenges. CBS 13's Adrian Moore is getting answers on how California wine producers are trying to stay competitive in a changing environment. Like many industries, we have cycles, and right now we're in a down cycle. Wine sales are flat. It's a topic on the minds of many industry professionals. There are some considerable challenges. And one of the biggest is growing competition from other alcoholic beverages. The adult beverage marketplace is a very crowded marketplace. We compete with distilled spirits and beer and hard seltzers. Drinks which are easy to take on the go. Something that's got wineries taking notice. To combat that, we do have wine in cans. It's exciting to see wine producers uh, looking at convenience packaging. Another industry problem is hiring enough people. There are some regions of the state that struggle to find enough workers for harvest. Low unemployment numbers and concerns over immigration policies have created plenty of job vacancies in the field. We're really having to work harder today to recruit those workers. Growers are also lobbying lawmakers to improve the nation's immigrant guest worker program. Congress, in fact, now is considering a bill to, to do just that. And with technology changing, highly skilled workers are also in high demand. That's where places like UC Davis's specialized wine study program comes in. The industry is investing in education, recruiting to deal with labor issues in the winery as well as the vineyard. But we do have the advantage of it's California, it's sunshine, it's wine. A lot of people are attracted to that. Yeah, it's hard to believe wine sales are flat. Yeah. Not in my house. <laughs> right. Grapes are California's either. second largest agricultural commodity, by the way, contributing a whole bunch of money, more than $50 billion to the economy each year.